Hello students now we will be solving memory based questions of gate 19 for more video solution on gate 19 subscribe to our channel and don't forget to click bell icon for instant notification Hello students myself Krishna Kant in this video we are going to solve a question from the subject communication and this question belongs to the chapter band pass data transmission so first of all let us start by reading the question a single bit equally likely to be 0 and 1 is to be sent across ewgn channel with power spectral density n not by 2 then binary signaling with 0 as p of t and 1 as q of t is used for transmission along with optimal receiver that maximize that minimizes the bit error probability let psi1 of t comma psi2 of t be ortho normal set and if we choose p of t equal to psi1 of t and q of t equal to Minus psi one of t, then we get error probability as p sub x e. But if we choose p of t equal to psi one of t and q of t equal to square root of e into psi two of t, then to get the same p e, the value of e must be same. E must be what? The options given are a zero, b one, c three, and d two. So see here. So we are having one bit. This is to be transmitted. So one bit means it can be either. Zero or one, and it is what equally likely means both are having equal probability. And what he has told, this is transmitted over AWCM channel, and okay, and uh, zero is to be coded as what is to be coded as rectangular signal that is P of T and one as Q of T. And what are the ortho normal sets he has given? The ortho normal sets he has given as pi one of T comma psi two of T. So first case he has given. If p of t is psi one of t and q of t is psi two of t, this is the first case. If we transmit bits like this, what we are getting? Probability of p. Then what he is asking? He is not coding like this. Now he is coding in this way. And in order to get the same probability of error, what must be the value of e? So the simple approach is what? The simple approach is constellation diagram. The ortho normal set he has given is what? Psi one of t and Psi two of t. So for the case one, this is case one. So bit p of t is where at one unit distance from pi of t means this is bit one, and bit zero sorry bit zero is at pi one of t, and bit one is q of t na. It is there at what minus one. So this is the first case, first constellation. If you transmit bits, this is the constellation points you will get. For the second case, how we'll get? For the second case, if you see, this is psi one of t and this is psi two of t. For the second case, p of t is what psi one of t. That is one into psi one of t. And for q of t, it is what square root of two, the square root of e into psi two of t. Means it is here. So these two must be having what same probability of error. So we know when two constellations will have the same probability error when the distance between those two points are same. When the distance between the these two points are same, when the distance between those two points are same in that constellation, then the probability of error is same. So what is the distance between these two? This is one and minus one, so the distance is two. For this, what is the distance? This is what? This is right angle triangle, right? So what you will be getting hypotenuse is nothing but square of sides one square plus square root of e square is e. That implies two two square equal to one plus e. That implies e equal to three. Means when e equal to three, the distance between the two constellation points will be same. Whenever distance between two constellation points are same, the probability of error is same. So the answer for this is three. That is option C. So option C is the answer. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked it. Don't forget to like and share the video with your friends. Thank you.